This fish is about to be impaled with a giant metal spear. And I don't know it yet, but something's about to go very wrong. Right after I took the shot, the line got tangled. On top of that, it was a pretty poor shot. In this scenario, if you're unlucky, two things can happen. You lose the fish, or you lose the fish, and you lose your gun. So my plan was to stay close to the fish while untangling the line, and the spear hopefully wouldn't tear out. Luckily, I was able to untangle it, but there was still a solid chance that the fish would break free. So I let it swim around and tire itself out while very gently pulling it up. When it was about 15 feet deep, my buddy swam down, loaded just one of the rubbers on his gun, and secured the catch. Mahis change color from yellow to bluish white when they get stressed, and there aren't many things more stressful than a knife to the brain. Let's talk about stabbing fish in the head for a moment. It looks cruel, and it is cruel, but if you're going to eat fish, putting them out of their misery as soon as possible is the kindest thing you can possibly do for them. It also helps preserve the quality of the meat. Speaking of which, 